How you doing? So um, I'm going to do things a bit different. Now do excuse the quality of the video in terms of visuals. I can assure you that the content will be rich. It's just that today has been very different. Um, this recording has taken place on the 7th of April 2020, where the whole world is on a lockdown. Well, the UK is on lockdown. As we speak, China's recovered extremely well and they are distributing products all over the world, like sanitizers, hand sanitizers, face masks, gloves, humidifiers, all different types of products to protect you from the coronavirus, okay? China has over 6,000 manufacturing plants built as we speak and they are thriving in business. And if you wasn't aware, China, they th have been thinking a hundred years into the future in terms of being becoming a superpower. Okay. What does that mean? It means that a lot of colonization will take place. So in terms of certain borders, you will definitely have selected folk from China go in to certain people groups and introduce the concepts, the mindset of China so that everyone's thinking on one accord. We're talking domination here. So, with that in mind, this is a great time of opportunity. And everyone sees things differently, you know? Um, you can have a think from a half empty or half full perspective. If millions of people are saying there's no jobs, it's a perfect opportunity to create one. And you'll have millions of people flocking you for work, you know? So in these times of uncertainty, it's a great time to set up your business. Now, I don't know what you're passionate about, what you love doing, what your ideas are. I know my approach is different tonight. It's just that it's been long and it's been on my heart to share something with you. And I stuck some like chips in the oven <laughs> and some chicken. And I just felt like just sharing a raw, rugged, face-to-face, heart-to-heart video with you. Because I know right now there's a ton of people that are struggling in terms of finances. Because the reality is, when it comes to financial security, the best way you can be financially secure is to be self-sufficient. And if you've got a skill, a vehicle, anything that can generate income, it's important that you use that vehicle to generate income um, until you find yourself in employment, so to speak. Even when you do find yourself in employment, always keep your vehicle alive. That's going to create assets and not liabilities. Because when people don't have the answer, what are you going to do? You can't point it where well, you can point your fingers and blame people. I mean, one day you can have a job and the next day you lose it. That's what's happening around the world as we speak. 
people are just losing their jobs. What do you do? Depend on the handout, a stimulus package. Because if you do that, then what's that backed by? If that's backed by your mortgage, your house, if that's backed by something that you own, an asset, the reality is, if you're depending on your job to pay back the loan from the government, the chances are you may lose that job. And if the interest has been whacked up on that loan, you're going to be in a bit of a pickle, which means you're going to be in a bit of a predicament. You're going to have problems. In times of uncertainty, people take, they tend to make decisions based on fear, worry, anxiety, etc. So, um, if you do have any skills, ideas, things that you're passionate about, turn your passion into profit and create a blog. I think that's a great place to start for any single person that is in a situation where they can see that um, change is coming and you know you need to do something, not now, but right now. I think one of the best things you can do is become an expert in a field that you're passionate about, whether that be cooking, driving, teaching, um, creating products, services, speaking, you know, elocution skills, education, you could be a scientist, you may have whatever information you have that you can share with the world, package it into a product and sell it online. And by starting a blog, you're building trust. When you build trust with people and you become likable, people will then invest in you, you see? So it's easy having the skills, but until you have like a platform where people can listen to you, hear you, learn about what you can deliver, see what you can deliver, where they can see testimonials about stuff that you've already done, only then will people invest in you. It's important. I believe that everyone should have a blog pertaining to whatever industry they're in, a personal blog. And to monetize it, like I said, turn your information into packages, whether it be an ebook, a video, a course, a podcast. People can stream your podcast online. And you can offer like, don't um, have a button where people can click on it and make donations if they believe in what you are doing. If it's adding value to them and they believe that you can add value to others, people will support what you are about. So a great place to start is by creating a blog. How do you create a blog? Well, there's plenty of videos on YouTube that will show you how. However, I've got links in the description box below. You can click on them links and learn. I'm here to support you. If you need support with your digital marketing, um, videos, if you have a ministry, as an example, maybe you have a church, and due to the economic collapse, you need to get offline and go online and stay connected with your people, then I can help you. I can build platforms that will keep your people connected. Anyway, this isn't a time to fear. This is a time to build. Okay, so I encourage you to feed your faith, starve it out, brainstorm, get a piece of paper, write down all the things that you enjoy doing, and then look at how you can monetize your talents, your gifts, right? It's important. It's important. There's plenty of room at the top and we need to help each other. There's plenty of room at the top. So I encourage you to take massive action, simple steps, day by day, until you get to that place.
where you know you truly want to be. So be the change you want to see. Subscribe to my newsletter. There's a link in the description box below. 100% free. I've got a um, site where you can literally learn about systems, formulas, online marketing, affiliate marketing. I started out as an affiliate marketer in 2008. I was invited to an internet marketing seminar and met a gentleman called Mark Anastasi. He went on to be a multimillionaire. I was featured inside of his book, The Laptop Millionaire. I started to take copious notes and follow what certain things that he was doing and I was getting rewards for doing so for creating systems and adding value. If I can do it, you can do it as well. So here I am. It's been a privilege and an honor speaking to you at such a time as this. Your next step is to connect. Let's build. So thank you for listening and I'll speak to you very soon. God bless. Bye.